How's it going? Man, you work too much. Yeah. I saw you down there slaving away. A beautiful day like this. Spending the day four wheeling up into the high country. Just now stopping to lock it into four wheel drive and you can make out 13,000 foot Buffalo Peaks wilderness up ahead in the distance. See how high we get before we got a hike. I'm gonna start zooming Man, in. That is beautiful. <laughs> okay, I'm zoomed in. I'm gonna zoom out. And then I slowly pan up. And then I slowly zoom in. Now we're coming up on the ridge. Buffalo Peaks Wilderness. We're soaking wet, had to pay our dues hiking in the rain to get here. Clouds are moving off. We're going to at least get above tree line. I'm not sure if we're going to bag that peak. So reach the saddle here in the Buffalo Peaks Wilderness, 11,000 feet. This is only a 13,000 foot range. And still a little bit of snow back there. It's amazing that an alpine flower can be this delicate and this harsh of a setting. Single fist and double fears. Yeah. Well, I guess that's rain at 12,000 feet. That doesn't mean you can't still take time to stop and smell the alpine flowers, especially when you see these cool little microclimates, man. These little tucked in spots that hold snow late, hold that moisture, and are out of the wind. And not to mention a microclimate might come in handy or a rock cave if this storm keeps coming in on us. Like as a, as a rain fly, I've used it before as that. God, man. God, look at that sun peeking through the clouds. What's your weather prediction again? We're going to have clouds in a little bit. We apparently are running out of our wind there. Oh my Clouds god. The Here they come. Here come the clouds. West Buffalo. And there's East Buffalo. Hike for another day. So we made it up here to West Buffalo. And that's East Buffalo. Thank you. 
I'm kind of like in Colorado. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha